Welcome to YouTube by DJ Spear C. Today I'm doing a little bit something different. I'm gonna, we're gonna talk. I have one of my friends here uh, from Byte FPV. I will put a link in the bar in the description of his channel. Go check it out. It's awesome. Uh, if you like uh, FPV stuff flying, he's your guy. But let's talk a little bit of uh, better FPV, the Cetus Pro and the Cetus uh, X. And the Cetus X. If you don't mind, let's talk about it a little bit. All right, so we just got this in. It's the Cetus X. It's an 85 millimeter uh, whoop drone. Uh, so if anybody's been flying previously with, like I say, a 75, this is a 1S450. Now this guy is taking two cell, so you can reuse your batteries, two four cell 1S to make a two cell in series 450. Now this guy, the differences between the earlier models, you could actually program this guy by hooking it up with a separate USB dongle. It's actually USB-C, and then you could actually hook up to Betaflight and do all your rates, programming, PIDs. Another good feature about this guy is for beginners, you could actually tone down and have an adjustable camera angle. And then you have a more aggressive look at it uh, when you're flying. Uh, I'm... Absolutely. So okay. as you adjust your uh, uh, camera angle, you naturally want to always stay a little up. So more camera angle, more speed. And, and then also the new goggles that come with the drone uh, now has a DVR, so you could actually record your flights and post them to YouTube like most people. It's a much improved display, integrated antenna. And this is something you similar do with yours? You do have a PVR on your machines? Yes, I, I run the uh, Fat Shark HDO2s and with an internal DVR, and that's how I post my analog flights on okay, YouTube. Okay, cool. And, and this, uh, uh, this is basically a basic remote from uh, Beta FPV? This or? is uh, the newer ELRS. It's the, uh, which model is it? It's the Light 3. So with the built-in ELRS. So uh, range and high-speed communication. So no worrying about out doing the range of your radio. You run out of video feed before you run out of radio range. Okay, that's the was a question I wanted to ask you. There's a lot of people will ask, how far can I go with this? Uh, will I still be able to control things like that? Oh, absolutely. Uh, this guy, you be have a clear transmission for uh, up to about half a kilometer. Okay. For all your Americans there, that's probably <laughs> uh, one a half mile, maybe, or something. Yeah. yeah. You, we can, are you can do a half here. mile before you start getting excessive <laughs> breakup. Yeah. That's one thing we sometimes I do forget. Uh, a lot of our stuff is in kilometers, and Americans are in miles an hour. All for the rest of the country that know what are kilometers, and you know what it is. Okay. So yeah, excellent beginner drone, very tough, forgiving. You can crash it, bash it. It will turtle mode off of the ground, off of grass. Uh, and it's an excellent starter kit. And when you move on to something more advanced, the goggles here can be used as a passenger seat for the family, friends to see what you're doing and flying. And this radio could actually be used for any other quad in the future. That's what I wanted to ask. Yeah, can can you reuse the remote for other stuff absolutely. like uh, Spectrum? You can. Yes, you can. absolutely. So if you have multiple quads, this controller could do multiple uh, quads as well. Is this remote multiple uh, but, uh, motor protocol? Should I no, say? No, this uh, this okay. one is just ELRS. Okay. So it doesn't have the multi-protocol module, but I find ELRS is the superior protocol going forward today, being open source, and it just performs flawlessly so far. Okay, cool. This is, like I said, this is not a really a video I usually do. I will put uh, a link in the description of Byte FPV if you want to go check my friend Phil's uh, channel. It is awesome. Uh, he does a lot of night flying, things like that, and he tests the range, believe me. <laughs> uh, but if you are interested in the beta FPV, like the Cletus Pro or the, this one is the X you said? Yeah, the Cetus X. The Cetus X. Uh, go check out Great Hobbies. www.greathobbies.com for all your great hobby needs in Canada. Thank you for watching. And if you have any comments or a question, post them below. I'll try to answer you guys uh, for the... Uh, <laughs> The quad questions, I'm not an expert, but worst case scenario, I'll ask my friend Phil here from Byte FPV to answer you guys. Thank you for watching.